The newest launch trailer for Multiverses just dropped, and with it came a whole bag of goodies, Easter eggs galore. If you haven't watched it yet, I definitely suggest going to see it before this one. Uh, the reveals were absolutely insane at the end. To get the obvious ones out of the way, Jason and Agent Smith were confirmed in the end shot of the trailer, and on top of them, there seems to be at least four more villain slots that we might be able to expect this first season. Going back to the start of the video, we obviously see the Warner Tower in the Hollywood lot, with Pinky and the Brain Balloons, Acme Lab buildings, and more. When the tower opens up, we spy four different artifacts jump out from the vault. Aquaman's trident, Samurai Jack's katana, Harry Potter's broom, and Bubbles' Octi stuffed doll. The next environment we see is the city of Townsville, with the talking dog sign behind Marvin and Mojo Jojo's volcano lair in the background. Another Aquaman reference appears within Wonder Woman's view from inside the Teen Titans Tower. The room they fight in seems to be a mix of many different of the members' room. Robin's sign, Raven's stuff, and Starfire's toys can be seen throughout the room. But more importantly is the Green Lantern right next to a portrait of Robin and Batman in the style of Teen Titans Go. Marceline's guitar can be seen on Tree Fort in a box of Scooby Snacks in the Haunted Mansion. Finally, before the big reveal, Joker is seen sitting in the Iron Throne in the throne room from GOT. That's all I can spot for now. See something I missed? Let me know in the comments below. I'm absolutely psyched for the next week when we finally get to try out these new characters. My name is Osti La Vista, and I'll see you on the next one.